Hey everyone, Forsh Restar here. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to create your own AI on Facebook Messenger. So let's get started. So let's start by opening up our Facebook Messenger app. From there on, we're going to click on the menu here. Now, once you click on the menu, if you have updated your app to the latest version, you should see the option that says create an AI. So you can click on that. And then what happens when you create an AI is it opens up AI Studio, which allows you to make an AI from scratch. Um, choose who can chat and then create it with respect. Basically, you can follow this step. So, you're going to hit continue here. And then you can go ahead and describe the AI. So, what does your AI do and what makes it unique? Uh, so, I'll put a, a unique fact AI or something like that. And then hit next. And then you can give it a personality, right? How you would like it to interact with roles and be a teacher, mentor, and then type of things as well. You can customize, add your own. So I'm just going to hit next. And then if you want to edit this background, let's see how background you want, right? You can generate these background or describe what to do. And then you can select OK once you're ready. There you can upload your own as well. So hit next. And you can give it a name. So, brainy babe. So, something like this. B. And then it next. And then how your AI would introduce to people. So, when people uh, want to do something, they can do that. And then we can review. And then if the audience level that you want to select, your friends, me. So, select any of this option, right? And then once you're ready, you would go ahead and create AI. And this is going to go ahead and create your own AI that others, depending on the audience level you pick, others can either interact with it or you can interact with it as well. So that's how you can go ahead and create your own AI just like that. And of course, there's a lot more customization you can do here that if you go around here, tap on it and then see things like the training, the accuracy, and then other things that you can do as well. So that's how you do it. I hope this video was helpful. If so, please consider the like and subscribe button for more tips and tricks. We'll see you guys next time.